Hello? Hmm? Is that so? 180 degrees? I don't believe it. Where? Iran. Now, where is that? Just a minute. How glad, nice land. Iran. Hmm. I'll be right over. <laughs> so this is Iran, eh? Uh, let's see what the little old guidebook has to say. Iran. Furnace of the Middle East. Chamber of Commerce stuff. Where the sun bakes all day and the earth cooks all night. Where the temperature sometimes reaches 180 degrees. Well, uh, propaganda. Here, the native beast of Burton, the camel, is the only one who doesn't mind the heat. I don't care what you say. I'm hot. <coughs> yes. So intense are the sun's scorching rays in this torrid region, so utterly devastating in their effect, that all human activity is reduced to a virtual standstill. Stand still, my foot. Why, they work like the very me. <laughs> don't stand still. It's off over the winding, tortuous route to the Russian depots in the north. The uncommonly steep grades are made even more difficult by occasional landslides that block the road. The merciless rays of the sun make daytime travel almost impossible. The winding, zigzagging path through the mountainous terrain of Iran presents a sharp contrast to the American driver accustomed to four-lane highways of his homeland. Iranian Railroad, with its network of 224 tunnels and 4,000 bridges. The railroad, too, has its landslides. Yeah, but this is no problem for an experienced railroad man. Cool. 